We're sitting with Phil Jacobson and Garrett Gottlieb, and they are the co-founders of Pump Up. Good morning. Good morning. This is pretty cool. This new app, and basically you can program in all of your different needs and desires, what yeah. you want to work on, where you want to do it from home, the gym. Equipment you have. Equipment you have, and it will be your trainer. You got yeah. it. That's amazing. <laughs> we try. So what, do, what kind of information do you have to input? How does, the, how does the application know who you are? You know, what better way than just to show you? Oh. So we actually ask you what your training goal is. So we, we support okay. weight loss, uh, general health and right. toning, mm -hmm. or building muscle. Yeah. Okay. So you choose your training goal. You choose what fitness level you are. So if you're a beginner, we say you average one or less workouts a week. But let's say we're an intermediate. And now we choose how long we want to work out for. So let's say we just want to work out for 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. And then we get to choose our equipment. So let's, it, let's say we're working out at home. Yep. And we have uh, a pair of dumbbells. Yep. And now we get to choose what muscles we want to work. So let's say we want to do a full body workout, nice, fresh, and early start to the morning. Yep. And uh, now we get to choose what add-ons we want. So we support cardio, but let's do a core circuit instead. A lot of people like our core circuits. I love this. Yeah, so now in real time, it's building you Look a workout and based on your parameters. Spinning. And then uh, you can actually see the workout. So it starts off with a warm-up. And we move on towards a strength section, so we have push-ups. And she's doing good push-ups. Look she at the is elbows. Doing Look at the elbows. Great, They're in. Great They're tucked ups. in. <laughs> Perfect form. Yep. And oh, some he's telling exercise you three ball sets, overhead 12 squats. Reps. Yeah. So, and we actually take you through the whole workout. If I press start, I'm not going to because we're not actually going to do it right now. But that's, <laughs> that that's how you terrific. build a workout. That is terrific. Yeah. With with uh, you've got demonstration. You've looked at all these different variables. The whole idea really is it, it kind of it's the personalization of a trainer, yeah. the guidance of a DVD or being with a trainer. And we actually recently released a community feature. So now you can actually share your results, progress pictures with your friends in the, the broader pump up community. And we're seeing a lot of people build followings, uh, share a lot of their workouts and the results. And it's really exciting to see. It helps you stay motivated. But why do you guys care? You're young, you're just naturally <laughs> fit. You don't have to work out or do you? So, um, you're businessman. Uh, no, mm. Phil's, well, you, Phil's you're a business tech. guy. And I'm now tech, yeah. but now, yeah, I guess I'm a businessman. Why the interest in fitness? I, uh, I've always been interested in health and fitness. I started working out with my dad in grade nine. Oh, nice. He would take me to the gym every morning. Really? About, about this time, oh, probably a little bit earlier. Great. And we'd go and work out. And uh, in university, I thought, well, my workouts are getting stale. Oh, yeah. I need an app that would you know, okay. change it up for me. So I decided to build this. And I love that you guys are Laurier and University of Waterloo. So this is something that's happening locally. And mm -hmm. your, your ideas were really supported in absolutely, that absolutely. area, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, the, the Kitchen Waterloo area, when it comes to technology startups, it's fantastic. Yeah. Uh, we're lucky to be part of the Velocity uh, program, which is, uh, I guess, an incubator, you can say, run by the University of Waterloo. They provide us mentorship, resources, free office space, and really the broader community of having you know, 30 different companies in one spot. Yeah, we all help each other out. Mm -hmm. um, and it, it's an amazing place to really start a company. So I mean, we're, we're lucky to be there, and uh, it's really helped us get going back in the early days. So did Velocity help you keep this idea at your own? Because I would imagine it must be somewhat intimidating. I've got this great idea for an app. But then you don't want to tell too many people. You don't right. want somebody else to hook into That's, it. Although you did take yeah. it to Dragon's Den. Yes. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Um, yeah. it's, it's actually a common misconception. Um, Tell me. Ideas are a dime a dozen, especially in technology. Mm -hmm. uh, this, for example, was not that easy to build. So if somewhere, someone else oh, were to build, come and build this for us right now, I would say go for it. Try. But it's, it's not that easy, trust me. Mm -hmm. So uh, there's a lot of, oh, there's a nice video. There you playing. go. Uh -oh, there's a lot some of bench press. <laughs> yeah. There we go. <laughs> I remember That's filming that. That was yeah. in our early yeah. days with the old logo. The Is that right? Yeah. yeah. Actually, one of the companies that was uh, developing a competing product, um, they decided to pivot a day before they released, and now they're called Thalmic Labs, and you can find them. They're pretty cool. They have a, a bracelet that detects your hand gestures. So lots of cool stuff going on in Waterloo, mm -hmm. and we're just proud to be a part of it. So Absolutely. what was it like on Dragon's Den? Well, Dragon's Den was a really cool experience. I mean, uh, going in, I guess, on the den, um, Maybe some would find it intimidating for us. We love to pitch. We love to really share, you know, what Pump Up's all about. So it was just a really cool experience for us. Um, what was interesting was more so watching the show. Uh, yeah, we had a nice party. Yeah, we had a nice party in Waterloo. Uh, all the community came out, uh, and we watched it. And it was interesting to see how they actually cut it. And we didn't actually end up uh, taking an offer on the show, mm -hmm. um, but it was definitely fun to uh, mm -hmm. to see ourselves on yeah. television. And you've got a lot of people. Whatnot. Downloading the app already, correct? Oh yes, yeah, we, we have over a hundred thousand people who use the app right now. Is it a free app? It's free okay. to download. It's called Pump Up on the App Store or on the Android Play Store. 
and uh, there is an option to pay for more premium features, but we're trying to keep it free and available to the mass market. And it's a mobile app. Completely yeah, mobile. Just completely the idea okay. is you, know, you have a trainer with you anytime, yes. anywhere, um, and now a fitness community as well. And I love the thing that you can choose in beginner, intermediate, or yeah. the more experienced, because I'm sort of in that middle ground, but never have a clue what to do in row would be, you know, you yeah. know exactly what you're doing, right. but probably get know what sometimes. I want to do. Yeah, 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 exactly. I know what I want to do, but it, it's nice that you can punch that in. And then the thing that I really love is the, uh, the visuals. I yes. mean, it looks like the, the, the form was bang on. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and, yeah. Thanks, guys. It's just great. And I love that you're local guys as well, <laughs> making a success of it. Phil Jacobson, Garrett Gottlieb, the co-founders of Pump Up, a great new app. Nice. Thanks for coming in this thanks morning. Thanks for having Thank us. You. Pleasure. 725. We'll be right back with your forecast and your headlines.